Hey guys, what's up? It's a girl over here. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're here, I'm on Abella 7117. And today, we're in a Minecraft build. You guys have never seen this before. It is my Minecraft Java Edition world that I made when I got Java Edition. And yeah, I'm going to tour it for you guys and give you a little tour. We're also going to do some stuff, look around, maybe start building something new. Show you everything I have. And yeah, let's get into it. But actually, before we start, go follow my Instagram. I'll post on there when I'm posting videos. And sometimes I'll post some stories, like if I'm playing Fortnite. I actually posted on my stories of me getting the green arrow skin. And I got the brand new email. So go check that out if you have Instagram. Also, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. And yeah, let's get into it. So as you can see, we have my house here first. I made it a little lake house. So we have our double doors with little torches. We got some chests. And well, these are junk chests for me strip mining this is just this chest full of stuff we have a blast furnace smoker furnace crafting table i was on another chest right here with my old armor in it we have my three dogs which um i don't know what to name the red one yet but i but these two are mom and dad that's the child um so that's pinky <laughs> this is junior but i don't know what to name the dad so I'll leave some name ideas in the comments um my little bed over here then we have kind of like a dock that's why i call it lake house i guess we have little cute things here with lanterns hanging off them. We have an oak boat there. We have a birch boat and a fishing rod right there. So that's pretty much just the house. The house is pretty small, but it fits all my stuff. So if we go right here, we have our farm. And we have the nether portal. Also right here is the strip mine, where I mine to find all my beautiful diamonds. Um... And yeah, we have our little farm here. We're going some potatoes and some wheat. Then if we go along this path right here, we have a little enchanting area. The floor is actually made out of books because, um, well, it helps with the enchantments. Because if you didn't know, uh, books going around an enchantment table help increase um, or help get better enchantments. So yeah, the floor is books. There's some books here. I'm trying to add more books, but I need leather. And for some reason, cows don't spawn in my area. Uh, it's surrounded by a spruce forest. So yeah. Then if we go over here, we have some sugar cane. It's my little sugar cane farm. And as you can see here, we have a beautiful bridge, which will lead up over here. With, well, we have little lanterns. It's a very nice view. Um, it goes over the lake, and over here leads to our campsite that I called Camp Awesome, created by the one and only LB, a.k.a. Little Bell 717. So when you first walk in, we have a nice little campfire. We've got some chairs that can sit at least three people per chair. Um, we've got a little campfire in the middle. So we can toast some marshmallows, or not toast, roast. Um, and yeah, so we have a little campfire here. Right here, we have the boys' cabin, which, you know, just has beds for the boys, because girls and boys, well, in my opinion, shouldn't share cabins, because you know what I mean. Um, so this is the boys' cabin. They're both kind of the same, except the beds are different colors. Um, we have the tents right here. So these tents they just have two beds. They can fit two people per tent. We have the light blue tent, and then we have the red tent. And then over here is the girls' cabin, which uh, has the um, girls' beds, which is really no different. It's just the beds are different colors. So, yeah, they're very small. It's a very small campsite. Um, I'm also thinking of adding a little bathroom so you don't have to, like, pee in the lake or something. Um, probably, like, right here. I'll, like, dig out this dirt right here and add, like, a little small, tiny, like, bathroom area. I'll put, like, like basically, like, a little room, except it's for the bathroom. So, yeah. That is basically a tour of my world. Um, I also put a bunch of bone meal down because um, I don't, it looks pretty. <laughs> uh, I haven't done anything in the nether yet. Like, I haven't really been in the nether too much. Um, I will give you a little tour of my strip mine, though. My strip mine's pretty cool. Um, so let's go down here. It is a little, it's, it's a bit far down. It's down to bedrock. Because uh, um, since I don't have coordinates in the side, and don't know how to turn on uh, coordinates on a Java edition. Um, basically, I just went down to bedrock. So we have this area here. It led to lava, so I just stopped here. So this is all the little strip mines. Um, what's that? Oh, wait, I don't remember that was from. That was from me trying to go over lava to see if there's anything there. Um, so then I started back here, and we have a bunch of these little areas here to strip mine. And it goes all the way far back to down there. I don't know why I'm hearing this noise from. As you can see, um, there's lava over there, so that's where it ends. So we have a lot to go on our strip mine, and then after we do, we finish this part, I'll probably go like a level above. Also, I keep hearing zombies and stuff, and it's really weird. Um, I just heard a skeleton die. Okay, uh, let's just go up here. 
So basically, we're just gonna leave the strip mine. The strip mine isn't too much. So if we do finish that part, um, I'll like level it off to like since it's right here, I'll start like right here mining. Um, I kind of do like hit it, something like that. Um, I also have a little area here because I didn't know what was Y12, so I counted, but I was confused on which one was Y12, so I just went down to bedrock. So let's get out of the strip mine. We'll go right up here. And I'll show you the enchantments on my stuff, I guess. I called this LB's Awesome Sword and LB's Awesome Bow, which has no arrows right now because I use them all. Um, so yeah, let's show you the enchantments that are on those. So let's just get up here to the surface. Let's go into my lovely little lake house with my dogs. And, alright, so my sword has sharpness 2, unbreaking 1, and sweeping edge. And if you don't know what sweeping edge is, it's something that's, like, only for Java Edition. Like, when I found it, I didn't know what it was either. Um, I'm pretty sure it just makes your attacks faster. I got it in the enchantment tables. Like, what's sweeping edge? Um, so I put it on there. My bow has power 2. My diamond axe has unbreaking 1. My diamond pickaxe has unbreaking 1 and efficiency 1. And then my diamond shovel has an efficiency one. And then my chest plate is the only thing that's enchanted on my armor. It has protection too, which is pretty good. So that helps. Um, and yeah, I think that's pretty much it. I also have a bunch of bone meal in here because I went to, when I went to the nether, I saw a bunch of bone blocks, so I got them. I literally got like less than 32 and got this much bone meal out of it. So yeah, I have some enchantment books in here. Smite one, sharpness one, power one, and another sharpness one. Which I'm thinking I'll add all the sharpness to my sword. But I didn't want to add it right away because I'm going to run out of levels. So yeah, I think that's pretty much it. I haven't really done anything else. There is an area where I get all my wool and stuff from. Basically, if I keep going down that way in a straight line, there's a giant plains biome with a bunch of sheep. There's, like, tons of sheep there. And then past that, there's a swamp biome, which is where I get my cows. Um, when I need leather or, like, meat or something like that. Um, I actually had some cooking in the smoker before I started. I wonder if it's finished. Yes, it did. Okay, there we go. Oh, and that brought me a level up. You know what? You guys deserve a tree. There you go. Um, okay. So, yeah, these are also flowers I put down. The purple ones and the pink tulips. I just put those down because why not? Um, is there anything else that I'm missing? Hmm. I think that's pretty much it. Uh, because I haven't built much. I started this world, like, a week ago. I also put a bunch of bone meal down here. Oh, I forgot to do it there. You know what? Let's do it. <laughs> it, it bothers me when I miss a spot, so I have to go do it. So, let's go grab the bone meal. Have tons. Never gonna run out. And if I do run out, it's gonna be for- it's gonna last a long time. Um, okay, which one? Okay, there we go. This one's 36, so it's already started, so let's just finish it off. I also don't really like the long grass too much, so I got rid of some of it. Um, like, if it's in front of something, it's hard to see it. So, I tried to take away a little bit of the long grass, not too much. Uh, oh yeah, I missed a ton of spots. <laughs> it bothers me a lot, I don't know why. Uh, let's get rid of that, and then we're gonna do this. We're going to put it just around the cabin. And there we go. I also missed putting bone meal down here. I was gonna put it here, but I, I forgot. And, okay, I think I should, let's get rid of the long grass. And get rid of that. I feel like the long grass for a campsite doesn't do good. Okay, yeah. I think that's pretty much it. Okay, so we added some extra bone meal. Let's put these seeds in the chest, throw this bone meal in the chest, and let's go to sleep because, uh, obviously, we're coming nighttime. And in uh, Java Edition, you can actually sleep during thunderstorms. Right, why is that? It started raining. Okay. Um, I actually haven't experienced a thunderstorm in Java Edition yet, so I don't know if that's possibly true. The thing is, um, uh, like, hold on. For thunderstorms, they, like, never happen. And I don't like thunderstorms, so I'm kind of glad to sleep through them. Um, yeah, okay. So if you, I, because thunderstorms, I feel like this, my house is going to get struck by lightning and get ruined. So I'm glad that you can sleep during thunderstorms. And yeah, there's also a lot of squids in the lake. There's tons of squids everywhere. Um, and there's, a, and there's some salmon, too. Um, I also do want to try and chant my fishing rod one day. So, let's... Hmm. Is there really anything else to show off? I mean, you can swim around in the river and stuff. It's a pig over there. Um, let's see. There's also a lot of wolves around here. Don't really know why. If you kind of go a little deeper over here, you'll probably find a wolf or two. Uh, so let's see if we can find one. 
just roaming around. Oh, I think our creeper blew up here and I forgot to fix it. Usually I fix the holes. Uh, I don't, wow, okay. The one time I don't see a wolf. Okay, hello, Mr. Pig. Um, all right, let's go back. And I think that's really all I can show off because I have nothing else to show off. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. So let's go back to the house. And so we can do our outro there. Hello, enchantment table. Um, I'm pretty sure the enchantment table has a mind of its own. <laughs> I don't know, just a thought. Minecraft theories. Um, alright, we are now back at my beautiful home. Also, if you notice, the roof isn't just flat. I put, like, slabs to make it nicer because I don't like flat roofs that much. But, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to smash that like button and comment down below. What do you think of my Minecraft Java Edition world and what other improvements can I make? And if you haven't already, please um, like this video. Follow my Instagram at littlebello 7 Link in the description. And, if, and subscribe if you haven't. And when you do, turn on the notification bell and click all. So you'll be notified whenever I post a new video on the channel. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye! Oh.